Hey church, recently we sat down and asked a few people in the church uh, three questions. Firstly, how long have you been at New Life Church? Secondly, we asked them, uh, what made you become a partner in fellowship at New Life Church? And then thirdly, why did you become part of the volunteer team that serves at New Life Church? Uh, this is what they had to say. Roughly, I've been in at New Life two years, two and a half years since I've been saved and uh, gave my heart to the Lord. So it's roughly two years. I've been at New Life Church for n over two years now. I've been coming to New Life Church since before the two or three hosts when Arnu was still here. I was invited by a friend of mine, Ilza, which drove me crazy every morning five o'clock when we walked or exercised. And eventually I exploded, I say, said, I'll come once and only once. And I've been here ever since. A lot of things have concluded for me to become a partner. The love, the, the patience, everything that the Word says. I've been living at Rai Chain at New Life Church. I came as a, a guest. Now I'm a partner. I'm a family member. It's been a, a journey, sometimes so difficult to explain, feel like I'm, it's coming out of a storybook, feel like somebody else's story to me, especially where we come from, what I've also been through. And once I've attended, there's things that was done to me in a transformation. And ever since my, my spirit actually settled right here with, with the family, with the people, and in this house of God. And ever since that ever happened and took place, there's no other place I can be. Well, at that stage of time, I lived in Hartenbos, and you know, there's many churches there, but for some reason, the Holy Spirit led me to this church, to New Life Church in Heiderand. The first Sunday I came here, they announced the Freedom Course. Ach, God, new mod. And at that time in my life, I needed freedom. And I attended the Freedom Course. After the Freedom Course, I got baptized, and I knew this was God sending me here. This is my home. You know, I came to church quite, quite a few times and I was looking all the time, you know, because I've been in, in quite a few churches where they actually would compromise their models or their beliefs to please people. And I was, I've, the first time I came, Basil was preaching and then Arne was preaching and Pastor Zane was preaching and before I knew it, it was a few years and I'm still here. So what I like about this church is they don't compromise, you know, they don't, they're not people pleasers, they're God pleasers. That is so important to me, you know, uh, I've always wanted to be served, I've always wanted to be in charge. I've always wanted to dominate. This is in my past life before I actually gave my heart to the Lord. And God started, or the Spirit started to transform me into the man I needed to be, not only for people, but for family, for my kids, and also for myself. And going through that, just volunteering, and it wasn't a decision that I've made. It was a process that I was going through after being baptized and reading the Word and the Lord taking me and putting me in places that I needed to be. And the day I made the decision to serve was actually the hardest decision I ever made as a person living in the world and doing things that are despicable, things that I shouldn't be doing as, as a fleshly person. The day I gave my heart to the Lord and He brought me through so many things and transforming me to be the person that I needed to be and through the stages I needed to be, becoming a partner, becoming a servant, was one of the, the things that it entailed for me to get to the place I needed to be. And once I made that decision, and I started in the car park, before I made that decision, it started transforming me, it, st it gave me humility, it started changing my life. So the Lord doesn't just change you, changes the people around you, but the things that you do. And being a servant, or even being person that, that, that serves transform me to the person that I needed to be today, not only for myself, but for my family, but for, for, for others. And it's a covenant and also uh, it's also something that I've, I've chosen to do that 
changes lives, it's changed my life, and it's a covenant that I made with the Lord that every Sunday, every every day, will I will be that person to inspire others like the Lord has inspired me. Also, a shout out to Uncle Colin, Uncle Francois Osman. These are strong men that every Sunday they there, they inspire me, whether it be raining, whether it be cold, and they have been a big influence in my life, and that also has played a major role in the place that I am today. And serving is one of the greatest things I can do. And it just started as a Sunday and it became a Monday, became a Tuesday, transformed my life. And um, God has been, been good to me. And uh, He's been leading my way. And everything that I do concerning serving, even in the church, has transformed my life outside. I started to go with my kids, Psalms 128, your wife will be a fruitful vine along the home. Your kids will be olive shoots around the table. And I've, in, I've experienced everything that the Word has said when I started to lay my life down. And in one of the scriptures it also says, you need to come down so he can be raised up. And God has enlightened, has enlightened my spirit. He's flamed me up, the fire. And just being a servant has really transformed mine. And I hope it, it sends out a message to others that everything lies with the Lord Jesus. Well, um, one of the staff members asked me if I would like to volunteer in the kitchen. And I said, yes, I would love to. And I'm very glad that they asked me. I love to serve in the house of the Lord. I became a part of the volunteer team is when I done, I done freedom, I done growth track and everything. And I thought to myself, okay, I'm not... I'm not signing up for anything yet. And then I came to do Freedom and I absolutely loved it. And then afterwards, when they, um, Dalian and them invited me to come and join them, I signed up and I've been with them ever since. So I absolutely love Freedom. And I, fa I fall in wherever I have to at New Life because it's part of the family. <laughs>